Welcome to Tai Chi. Everybody ready? Let's warm up. Hands at your waist, turn your neck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stretch your neck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Turn your shoulders. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Expand your chest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Waist exercise. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Airplane, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Touch toe. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Turn your hips. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Other way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Be careful. Shift your weight to the left foot. Good Tai Chi posture. Kick your right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Kick your butt. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Turn your knees. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other way. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Heisman, opening up your span, parallel feet, choose the right side, cross and sit on that side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Straight up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Short one. One, two, three, four, five. Other side. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, cross training. Font your own. Fingers wide spread, outstretch arms. Ibe, yat, ni, sam, te, n, look, tat, bat, bow, stop, reverse. Yat, ni, sam, te, n, look, tat, bat, Bow, stop. Okay. Hands at your waist, making circles with your foot. Gyokhoi mun. Going outwards. Ibe yat ni sam se mm look chat bat gao sop reverse yat ni sam se mm look Chat, bat, go, sub. Stand on your right, circle with your left. Ibe, yat, ni, sam, se, mm, look, chat, bat, go, sub. Reverse, yat, ni, sam, se, mm, look. Chat, bat, gao, sop. Okay, juk mu wan dong. Sand on your left, kick up the sand with your right. Be, yat, ni, sam, se, mm, look, chat, bat, gao, sop. Pedal forward, yat, ni, sam, ankle re uh, action, mm. Bat, gao, sop. Stand on the right, kick up the sand with your left. Ibe, yat, ni, sam, se, mm, look, chat, bat, gao, sop. Pedal forward, yat, press down on that pedal, sam, se, mm, look, chat, bat, gao, so, okay, new one. Hands at your waist. Open up your span. Here we go. Yat, ni, sam. Ni, ni, sam. Sam, ni, sam. Se, ni, sam. Mm, ni, sam. Look, ni, sam. Chat, ni, sam. Ba, ni, sam. Go, ni, sam. Sup, ni, sam. Okay? Add it one more, adding one more, okay? Similar but different. We're gonna go home and try to figure it out, okay? Not too many instructions. Start out in the same way, okay? Man, fayat, ni, sam, se, Mm. Look, chat, but go, sup. Okay, very good for first time and not too many instructions. Okay, so good golden cockerel. And uh, remember that safety comes first. Okay, good Tai Chi posture. Straight up, opening up our span. We're gonna use spiraling. We're gonna use shifting of weight and counterbalancing. Okay, and straight for our Dantian, straight up. Good, here we go. Golden cockerel.
Last set. Kicking out. 50-50, tuck in those elbows. Follow with your eyes, follow with your hand. Last set. Holding your ball, root down, good Tai Chi posture. Make it the best you can. T stance, L stance, bow the leg, O stance. Sit back, sit down, pivot. Root down on a T, bring it in, L, bow the legs, bow stance. Sit back, sit down, pivot, T stance, L stance, bow the legs, bow stance. Sit back, sit down, pivot, ball and T. Out on an L. Here it is. Listen carefully. Sit back. Sit down. Pivot. We're going to brush our knee. Set it up correctly. Multi. Turn the hips and waist. Magic begins. Sit back. Sit down. Pivot. Set it up correctly. Multi, turn the hips and waist, magic begins. Sit down, sit back, twist step, set it up correctly. Multi, turn the hips and waist, hands go for the ride. Make sure you're doing that. Sit back, sit down, pivot, set it up correctly, multi, Turn the hips and waist, brush your knee. Sit back, sit down, pivot, set it up correctly. Multi, turn the hips and waist, brush your knee. Sit back, sit down, pivot, set it up correctly. Multi and magic. Sit down, sit back. Pulsing of the monkey in the 10 form. Okay? Repulse, one. Center, higher, glance. Ear, turn, repulse, two. Where's set right hand coming? Skimming the hip. Center, higher, glance. Ear, turn, meet, Slide, center, higher, glance, ear, turn, meet, slide. Center, higher, glance, ear, meet, slide. Last one, center, higher, ear, turn, meet, Slide, holding our ball on a T stance. Out into the side, we're gonna part the wild horse's mane. One, sit back, sit down, pivot. Root down on a T stance, L stance, bow stance. Cloud hands, use your hips and waist.
Listen carefully. We're going into a single whip right now. Cloud hands. Okay, use your hips and waist. Last rotation. Middle, three o'clock hook, form your T, out L, turn the wrist, last single whip. Okay, half step, sit back, rock the front, lift off, high pad on the horse. Cross, step out with your heel to the left, gather the energy, center it by your Dantan, tuck the elbows, Kick out, follow with your hand and your eyes. In, L stance heel, double punch, finish it off with a nice curl. Sit back, sit down, turn all the way around, center and out. And in, toe down, plant yourself down, turn, pivot to the left, Come up, golden cockerel. Toe, spin, hook, split, sit down. Halfway, veer to the right. Set, swing up, golden cockerel. Out with your heel on an L, hold your ball. Out with your heel, turn the ball. Forehead, turn the hips and waist. Shuttles on her right. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, ball, L, turn the ball, forehead, turn hips and waist, shuttle, left. Half step to the back, across the hips and waist, all together, down to the bottom of the C. One hand, join it by the second hand, then your foot, start in the middle, heel out, lash arms. Sit back, sit down. Pivot, fist up, hand down, spin out to deflect, bring it in as a parry, forward as a punch. Touch, open the fingers, roll back, sit down. Come up, then forward. Twist, twist, in, embrace first, shift the weight up, in, push out, separate, tuck, drop, flex, as you now close your form, okay? Tai Chi walk, going backward, coming forward, okay? Hands at your waist, give yourself enough space. Good Tai Chi posture. Pivot out, walk in that direction, heel out, round the crotch. Both stands. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, zigzag in that direction, heel out, round the crotch. Both stands. Getting ready to hold your ball. Sit back, sit down, out, hold your ball, heel out, round the crotch, part the wild horse's mane. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, hold your ball. L stance, O stance. Sit back, sit down. Pivot out. Heel out of the heel. Part the wild horse's mane. Half step forward, hold your ball. Spin the ball, watch that advancing right hand. On your toe, lift it up. Parameters for white crane spreads its wings. Drop your front foot, tuck that elbow in as you bisect. Swirl back, look back at the right, lift up the front, brush knee one. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, set it up correctly, multi, magic. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, set it up correctly.
correctly. Mat uh, multi and magic. Half step, sit back, rock the front, play your lute. Drop the front foot, center the front hand, watch that back hand that's higher, lift up, toe, head, middle, repulse one. Center, higher, glance, lead with the toe, stretch out, heel, pivot, two. Center, higher, glance, lift up, stretch out, heel, pivot, three. Center, glance, higher, lift, modify, meet, skim your hips. Hold your ball on a T-stance. We're going to ward off. Out to the side, round the crotch, forearm your opponent. Set that space, keep that space. Turn the hips and waist, reposition the hands. Sit down, sit back, turn at the hips and waist to look back. Contact. Turn at the hips and waist, push from the center, separate the energy, roll back and sit down. Come up and then together lunge forward. Sit down, sit back, pivot, root down, T stance, L stance, ward off, set that space, turn the hips and waist, reposition the hands, Turn at the hips and waist to look back. Contact, turn at the hips and waist, push from the center. Separate the hands, roll back, sit down. And lunge forward and hold your stance. Now, all you do, I want you to do is look at your feet. Are you in a bow stance? Okay, and if you're not, can you fix it up now? You're supposed to be in a bow stance. So a bow stance means you still have clearance. Remember, if you drag that front foot back, do you have the clearance that we need? Fix it up, fix it up. L stance, better L stance. Okay, going on, sit back, sit down. Pivot, 12 o'clock cup, nine o'clock. Two things happen, middle cup, three o'clock hook, 12 o'clock out, single whip. Continuing, sit back, sit down, cup, three o'clock, cloud hands. Middle, flip meet close. Middle, flip meet open. Middle, flip meet close. Middle, two things happen. Middle, flip the hand. T stands, hook, out and to the side, single whip. Half step forward, sit back, rock the front, lift it up, high pat on the horse. Cross, step out to the left, gather energy, center it, and kick out right in. Down on an L, punch the guy's ears, finish with a curl, sit back, twist, shift your weight, center, left hand, left foot, follow in, down, split, down, halfway, veer to the left, up, golden cockerel, toe, spin, hook, Look, split, down, half wave here to the right, set and swing up, golden cockerel. Down with your heel, hold your ball, out with your heel, spin the ball, then twist, shuttle right. Sit back, twist out, hold ball, heel, turn the ball, forehead, Turn hips and waist. Half step to the back, across the hips and waist, needle to the bottom of the seat. One hand, two hands, and your foot, stretch the knee, clash arms. Sit back, twist, fist, high, low, out, deflect, bring it into parry, then out to punch. Touch. 
Roll back, sit down, come up, lunge forward. Twist, open twist, in twist, embrace, shift weight, up, in, out, push out, separate, drop shoulders, flex knees, gravity takes care of you as you now, close your form. Okay, not bad, not bad, okay? And there's always room for improvement, ongoing issues, okay? Not really issues, just sort of helping yourself to refine and making all those connections to your puzzle pieces rather than have any kind of um, stray uh, little points or jerks in that puzzle. We want to smooth out things, okay? Remember I asked you at one time, at one portion when you were facing the road, that to check your feet, because I could see that you were not adhering to your L stance and your bow stance. Do you, do you, could you, those of you who checked, or you all should have checked, could you see that something went a little bit haywire? I mean, not extremely, some yes, and some you could have improved on that stance. So knowing what you did from what you saw then how are you going to fix that up? You're going to be strict with yourself in your basic feet production and uh, uh, alignment. So remember that no matter what we do, and I think at the time we were warding off, and this is a good one because I need to remind you again that if you're not in the correct posture, you're gonna take a beating on your, uh, your knees, okay? And we don't want that to happen, okay? And we wanna be able to prevent something. So again, I'm gonna do it again, okay? But this time I'm gonna call some things out. So here we are, the elbows come in, they don't stick out, they come in and they help us relax. The same time they come in, our shoulders drop because we're rooted. So everything is in the optimal position. T stance, L stance, bow the legs. Oh, sorry, out, ward off. Remember we said that if we didn't set the space, we would be not in Tai Chi posture. So this is the spacing which I have to take. If I took it any further, I find that my core is following that hand that's too far forward. So if we take precautions and we are in the optimal space here for our martial arts intent, why should we extend any more to grasp the bird's tail? Okay. Why should we establish a good space and then come out to grasp the bird's tail. It doesn't make sense. Agree? Yeah? All right. So what I want you to be strict about is not only the foot. It came out and to the side. It did not just come out. Very little space for my knees to rotate. So you're going to have to start with that one first. Out on an L. Ward off. Where are my hips and waist? You use them. I don't use my hand. My hand set the space. My hand is right here to counterbalance me. I turn my hips and waist. Then I reposition my hands. One more time, I ward off. I set my space in my in good Tai Chi posture. Turn my hips and waist reposition my hands. I don't set my space, come out and reach for that grasping of the bird's tail. Okay? Hips and waist are leading my motion. Same tempo, sink down, make yourself small, come up the same way, lunge forward the same way. 
Okay, same temple, other side for other angle. Bring that elbow in, relax, centered, root it down for energy, L. Bottom hand advances, ward off. This left hand is very important. Some of the hands I see are way back over here. It's just right here. Turn hips and waist. Almost wants that back hand to move because I turn my hips and waist. Reposition my hand. Good Tai Chi posture still. Sit down, sit back. Turn at the hips and waist to contact. Turn again. Hands are moving only because the hips are moving. Separate, roll back, sit down, come up, lunge together. Ready to try, get in all those pieces. Going to the left, T stance, root down, relax those shoulders, bring that ball in. L stance. Hold the legs, ward off, set that space. Turn hips and waist, reposition hands. Sit down, sit back, turn at the hips and waist to look, contact. Turn at the hips and waist, center, push out. Separate, roll back, sit down. Come up in the same Rhythm to come out. Other side, sit down, twist, root down, center with the ball, make sure your shoulders are down. T stance, L stance, ward off. Good Tai Chi posture, good counterbalance. Turn the hips and waist, reposition hands, sit down, sit back, turn at the hips and waist to look back. Contact, turn at the hips and waist, center of the body, push the energy out, separate the hands, roll back, sit down, come up, lunge forward. Okay, no words, twist step, T. Then pause with your hold of the ball. Okay, so that one, can you improve on that? All right. Let's look at um, serpent in the grass. Let's get a little bit better, okay? And then let's try to move away from serpent and, and work on maiden and needle, okay? So we're at uh, kick out, kick out, left, in, serpent, Set up, set it up correctly. Then we sit down. As we sit down, the hand advances. This is my halfway when the fingers are down. When I pivot, I need to pivot out to the left. Up. Up, golden cock crawl. Toe, spin, hook, split, down, halfway, veer to the right, set, come up, golden cock roll, heel, ball, spin, twist, sit back, out, Ball, heel, rotate, turn, back, across, together,
Okay, watch this one now. Only the core takes you this way. Does not, the core takes you only to a certain extent. If you go beyond that, or if I go beyond what my core tells me, it becomes a hand motion. So you want to just use what the core gives you in expanding. Sit back, twist, form your fists, come up and go down, counterbalance hand, spin out to deflect, to parry, then punch. Okay, this one now, um, open that first, then come back down. Don't try to do too many things at once, okay? Okay, let's try that. So we're uh, double punching, okay, for now. Okay, right foot forward, double punch, finish up with that curl, sit back, sit down, pivot, left hand, left foot, up, kick out, left, in, toe down, drop down, halfway, veer to the left, and swing up. Toe, spin, hook, split, down, halfway, spin to the right, and come up, golden cockerel. Heel, hold your ball, heel, spin the ball, then turn hips and waist, shuttle right. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, hold your ball, spin the ball, turn hips and waist, shuttle left. Half step to the back, across the hips and waist, point that toe down to the bottom of the seat. One hand, two hands, then your foot, start in the middle, stretch out the knee, flash arms. Sit back, sit down, pivot, fist, spin out to deflect, bring it in as you parry and punch. Touch, open fingers, roll back together, sit down, come up, spiral forward. Okay, so yeah, you're getting better, hopefully, and you're figuring out, well, what is she doing or what is she teaching me that I should apply? So that's good, but don't just let it rest and forget about it until next lesson. Because we're not gonna get anywhere, or you're not gonna get anywhere if you don't build on what you have. Or I wanna caution you that when you do your maiden, it's definitely a zig, a zig, and a zag, a zig, and a zag but only when you do needle to the bottom of the C that you're straight on. If you don't, and also when you do your serpent, the serpent does not come out straight. It zigzags first to the left and then to the right or, or something like that. It, it, it alternates just the way maiden zigzags Serpent zigzags. So when you're in, so when you're this way, and then watch my head, okay? This is how I set it up. I don't set it up here because then I have to look there. I set it up for a good reason, right at eye level or right by my, my forehead, so I can see it with keeping my good Tai Chi posture. The hand comes this, the flat hand is in a new plane. I'm in my in a, a parallel toe position, I come down, I weigh down. Okay, my head is straight up. It never turns. My vision never turns. It just watches that hand. Halfway, I'm going to firm down and I'm gonna turn out to my left. Left, not straight now, okay? So how do we get that? I had a hard time because my foot kept on slipping further out. So remember I said, you don't want a small area, you want a medium area that's comfortable so that you can post and then halfway 
you want to turn out to the left. We want that golden, um, golden, golden cockerel on your, like this, this way. We don't want the thing this way, okay? So we want him this way. We want to come down. We want to come here. We're parallel. We're on the line or parallel to the line. We want to split. We want to come down. Halfway, I want to veer now to my opposite side, which is the right. And there is a purpose for that. So that when we come out to hold our ball, when we come, when we're a golden cockerel, we hold our ball, we come out. For me to get to the right hand side to shuttle, I need this zigzag. I need to go to the opposite extreme so that what? My hips and waist can go fully to the right. Pivot out slightly, not too extreme. Hold your ball, zigzag, turn. I have enough space so that I can fully turn. If I did not, on this last one, um, pivot out, watch what's happening. I don't have anything to turn. I gotta stop there. If you say, well, I can go this way, then you're not in good Tai Chi posture because the hips are facing this way, but your upper body is not matching, it's going the other way. So there is a reason for coming out, holding your ball, coming out, spin, no rush, then turn. Hardly any hand motion because I'm using the power of my hips and waist, okay? It's easy to understand, easy to follow, but then hard to, like all the time, hard to apply. So we just have to, we really have to work on it. And the more you can work on it, the more your body will tell you, it will snap together and will say, it's logical, it makes sense. Okay, let's, let's, um, let's start with the sec uh, first serpent this way, road way, okay? And let's see if we can fix it up. Main thing is to zigzag. When maiden shuttles, when maiden pivots out, don't take a far pivot out, okay? Hook hand right, left hand closer to your body, toe down in a, a comfortable width, Okay, serpent in the grass. Come down, sit down. Hand to the center. Hey, I didn't even tell you to go that way yet. Who, who's teaching you? Okay, so if you want to learn how I want you to learn, then what I call out is what you have to do, okay? Don't, don't rush it, okay? Hook hand, left hand closer to your chest. Split that toe down in a parallel at the at the uh, heel of your planted foot. Sit down. Lower, hand goes to the middle of your body. The fingers are pointing down. Twist out to the left and the hand is forward, the hand suspends. Come up, golden cockerel. Toe, spin, hook. Kind of glance at what I'm doing. Split, come down. Halfway is when the fingers are down. Are you with me? Pivot on the heel to the right. Suspend. Swing up, golden cockerel. Okay? Heel down, hold your ball. Hold your ball, shift your weight. Spin the ball, heel out, all the way to the forehead, then shuttle right. Sit back, sit down, slightly pivot out, hold your ball, heel out, spin the ball, not your hips, then your hips to the left. Half step to the back, across the hips and waist, set up the right hand, down to the bottom of the sea. Okay. So I'm here. 
I kicked out left. I'm forward. I have this down already. All I do is sit down. But in sitting down, this is my halfway. Okay, so you don't want this, this hand to, you want it always to be near to you. This is my halfway when the hand fingers are down. Then watch this back hand. It doesn't go any place but swings back to hook back. And I'm not straight ahead. I should be veering. So some people have problems to pivot all the way to the left. Okay, so how am I doing that? Of course, it has to be halfway. I'm leave, uh, alleviating the weight. I'm turning and spinning, using my hips and waist to be in this suspension. Okay, I don't want the hand too much to come down, but I want it to suspend this way. Then swing up, golden cockerel. Toe, spin, hook, look, parallel, split out, come down, sit down. Halfway, what am I going to do? Spin out to my right and then suspend, shift the weight, come up, golden cockerel. L stance, ball, L stance, rotate, turn hips and waist, sit back, twist out slightly, hold your ball, heel, spin the ball or rotate, set it up correctly, turn hips and waist, shuttle, left, half, step to the back, across the hips and waist, set up this hand, all together down. Up one, up two, up with your foot, three. Stretch out, only to where your core help allows you. Sit back, sit down. Twist, fist high, low on your toe. Heel out, deflect, parry, punch. Okay, let's try that starting with uh, double punch, okay? Everybody knows double punch by now. Right foot forward on an angle, on a zigzag. Double punch, curl in, sit back, all the way around. Left foot, left hand up, out, in, hook, split, sit down, halfway. Veer to the left, suspend, swing up, golden cock crawl. Toe, spin, look, split, down, halfway, veer to the right, suspend, swing up, golden cock crawl. Heel, hold your ball, spin the ball, heel, forehead, then turn hips and waist, shut all right. Sit back, slightly out, hold ball, heel, spin the ball, set it up correctly, magic of the hips and waist. Half step to the back, across the hips and waist, set up the right hand down to the bottom of the C, one hand, two hands, and your foot, start in the middle, flash arms. Sit back, sit down, pivot up and down, spin out to deflect, bring the parry, and then the punch. Okay, so you're gonna take this home and, um, and work on it, okay? Uh, I see things, but I also see things that are, are, I can see you, hear you, watch you thinking the process. So that's a good start. Then think it through, watch it, then try to apply it. And um, it's not easy. It's, it'll take us a while, but I don't want to keep on um, you know, hammering it because I want it to just kind of rest with you, sit with you let it kind of soak in and then you try it out for yourself. Um, 
once you get any part of it a little bit better, you'll feel good. Okay, so work on it, just like anything else. First, when you first came, parting of the wild horse's mane and brush knee were hard. And so now we have some other more difficult ones and it'll take time and then you'll get it. But don't forget and don't be afraid that the hips and waist drive your movements and have the confidence to don't, don't go fast. If you can slow it down and say, this is what I'm going to do, this is what I'll do, and then I'll get to the next point, that's the way to do it, okay? That's the way to tackle it. Any questions? Any questions? Yeah, that's, that's difficult. But um, I think that I've heard you tell me that when I first, when you first came and you learned it, it was really hard and now you've gotten a grip on it. And so now, you know, each time you experience something, it's going to be hard and then it'll get easier with, with time. All right. All right, let's do the 24 in five minutes, okay? Okay. Commencing form. Shift weight. Open. Rotate. Deep breath. Reverse, tuck the elbows, flex the knees, hold your ball on a T stance, out and to the side, part the wild horse's mane. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, hold your ball, out with your heel, round the crotch, part the wild horse's mane too. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, hold your ball, Heel out, round the crotch, part the wild horse's final. Half step forward, hold your ball. Spin the ball as you watch the advancing right hand on the toe, lift it up, get the parameters to slice through your shoulder. Drop your front foot, tuck the elbow, bisect, swirl back and look at the back, lift up the front, magic begins. Sit back, sit down. Pivot out, set it up correctly, multi, magic begins. Sit back, sit down, pivot out, set it up correctly, multi, turn the hips and waist. There you have it. Half step forward, sit back, rock the front, play your lute on your heel. Weight on the back, center the left, Higher on the right, lead with your toe, the pulse of the monkey, one. Center, higher, glance, lead with the toe, stretch out, heel, pivot, three. Center, higher, glance, lead with the toe, down, repulse, sorry, three. Center, higher, glance, lift, modify, meet, slide. Hold your ball on a T stance, out and to the side, ward off, set that space. Turn the hips and waist, reposition the hands, sit down, sit back, turn at the hips and waist, look back, contact turn at the hips and waist, center push out, separate, then roll back and sit down. Come up, lunge forward, other side, twist, root down, T, center, L, ward off to a certain extent, turn hips and waist, reposition hand, sit down, sit back, turn at the hips and waist to look back, turn again, push out, separate, roll back, sit down, come up, lunge forward. Sit back, sit down, twist, cup, nine o'clock, 12 o'clock, shift weight, hook, out, single whip. Sit back, sit down, twist, clout hands. Can't be clouds unless your hips and waist are engaged. T, 
Look at the hook, across face L, single whip. Half step, sit back, rock the front, lift up, high pad on the horse, cross, step to the left heel, gather energy, center it, come in, follow with your right, in, L stance, heel, double punch his ears, curl, sit back, pivot all the way around, left foot, left hand up, kick out, left, in, toe, look, down, halfway, veer to the left, set, swing up, hold and cock roll, toe, spin, look, stretch, down, halfway, veer to the right, sweat, stretch, swing up, golden cock roll, heel, ball, rotate, then turn hips and waist, shuttle right, sit back, twist out slightly, hold ball, spin ball, turn hips and waist, shuttle left, half step to the back, Cross the hips and waist, set up the right hand, point the left toe down. Up one, two, foot, stretch out. Sit back, sit down, pivot. One sweep up, deflect, parry, punch, touch. Sit back, sit down, pivot up and out, twist, open, in, embrace, shift weight, rotate up, in, out, drop shoulders, flex knees, tuck elbows as we now close our form, okay? Very smooth, very simple, very logical, okay? Think about that.